We recently went camping on the lake for a few days with some friends and family. And despite all the temptations, we were actually able to stay keto the entire time. So today I'm going to share with you some keto camping meal ideas that you can bring to your next camping trip. I think the key to staying keto focused is being prepared. So many of these meals I prepared ahead of time. They are simple, relatively easy to make, and you don't have to spend a lot of time prepping or cooking when you're camping. I broke them down into breakfast, lunch, dinner, snack, and dessert ideas. So follow along so I can show you how to stay keto when you're living outdoors. Breakfast is pretty easy to do when you're camping. You can't go wrong with sausage, bacon, or eggs. And those are all pretty easy to make and pack when you're camping. And if you have a camp chef like we do, I highly recommend that you make sure that your grill is level before you attempt to scramble the eggs, or else it will take you three people to scramble them so they don't end up on the ground. Chia pudding is my favorite camping breakfast. I made mine up ahead of time at home in the blender and then poured it into mason jars and popped it in the cooler. It's easy to grab in the morning when you're headed out early to go fishing or hiking. I'll leave a link in the description below for the full recipe for my strawberry and cream chia pudding. You can also sub for different berries or nut milks if you'd like. Pancakes are another essential camping breakfast. These are my mason jar keto pancakes. I prepped the dry ingredients ahead of time along with the wet ingredients and separated them into separate jars. On the morning that we wanted to have them, I just combined both jars, I gave them a good shake, and cooked them on the skillet. If you want to learn how to make these amazing keto buttermilk pancakes, the recipe is in the description below or you can also visit my Instagram page at Keto Focus. For lunchtime, we're usually on the go, so that's why I like to make keto wraps. I use coconut wraps that I get from Thrive Market, and I'll leave the link in the description box below if you're interested. What I do with these wraps is I usually spread softened cream cheese first, and then you can top whatever meat or cheese combination that you like. After that, just roll it up and wrap it in saran wrap or put it in a Ziploc bag and you're good to go. Keto sandwiches are another easy portable lunch option. The buns are keto and they're made by the Smart Baking Company. It's great because they're actually zero net carbs. I order mine from Miracle Noodle and you can use my code KETOFOCUS to get 10% off your order and free shipping. I love these buns because you can use them for sandwiches and hamburgers, top them with whatever you like. And if you're just lounging around camp and want something off the grill, I highly recommend that you make these bacon and onion wrapped hot dogs. They are just stuffed with cheese and pickle and wrapped with a ring of onion and a strip of bacon.
Keto dinner options can be a struggle while you're camping. We like to do hamburgers. You can have them buntless, lettuce wrapped, or use the smart buns on your next burger. Foil packs are easy to do too when you're camping. You can add any meat, veggie, cheese to the foil and just grill it over the open fire. They're super delicious. I like using sausage with some bell pepper and onions. And I always add a little bit of butter for some flavor and a little extra fat too. You can also use radish diced up in the foil packet as well. They taste just like potatoes when they're roasted over the fire. I like to add a little bit of bacon and cheddar and even steak and you've got yourself a killer keto meal. Taco in a bag is a well-known camping meal. I made a keto version using pork rinds instead of chips. In a small bag of pork rinds, you just add some taco meat, onion, bell pepper, tomato, cheese, shredded lettuce, avocado, whatever toppings you want. Then just give it a good shake and you can pour it into a bowl or just eat it right out of the bag. Trail mix is a good option when you're out hiking or out on the boat all day. I have another video showing you the step-by-step -step on how to make this tasty trail mix, so you should check that out. I'll leave the link below in the description box. And no camping trip is complete without roasting some marshmallows and making s'mores. I have a video on how to make keto s'mores, so you make sure you watch it and learn how to make keto graham crackers and marshmallows. We had these every night when we were camping. It's one of my favorite parts of camping. When you huddle up in the fire, and you're roasting marshmallows with the kids. You can also make a s'mores dip if you have a cast iron skillet. And I show you how to make this in my s'mores video as well. I hope these ideas help you stay keto focused on your next camping trip. Check out my other videos for this full step-by-step -step, and make sure you subscribe to Keto Focus so you don't miss any more of my keto cooking adventures.